Hey Pete, would you like to learn how to make a greenhouse out of the egg carton? Pete says, yeah. I think it'd be fun. All right, so you hang out here and I'll show you how to make a greenhouse. All right, so I'm going to put on some gloves, my garden gloves. So now's the time when it would be a good time to start growing some plants, especially if you have a garden which I do, I have a little garden, and I love yummy tomatoes and peppers, all kinds of veggies. So, this is a really easy way to start growing your plants. And I thought, since we're talking about Easter and eggs, what better way to make a homemade greenhouse? out of the egg carton. Everybody has egg cartons. And this is a great way to recycle them. So what you need to do is get an egg carton that's made out of cardboard. And you need a pair of scissors. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut the lid off. Now remember, this is a good way to practice our cutting skills. Like when I come into your classroom, remember, you want to put your thumb in the little hole and you want your three tall guys in the, the large hole right there, okay? And then when you're cutting, remember, you want your thumb up to the sky. You don't want to twist it. Thumb up. All right, so here we go. Let's cut. All right, once you got that cut off, you can put that aside, and we're gonna cut this little lip off here. Remember, keep your thumb up. There we go. And you can just put this over here. So all you need is this part. Now, you need some soil and I like to use a cup and you're going to put a little bit of dirt in your cup and you probably want to do this outside that way if you spill some dirt it's not a big deal so you're gonna fill each one of these holes with some dirt just a little bit All right, and then I like to use my finger and just push it down. So you wanna fill all these holes up, all right? Which to save on time, I did that already for us. So yours will look like this when it's all done. Now, you'll want some seeds. And I am going to plant some sweet pepper seeds. Now before I get started, I like to use, I have this little wooden stick. You could use a pop, popsicle stick or you could even use your finger. But I like to poke holes in the soil and that's where my seeds go. And it's really fun. All right, so I'm going to cut my seeds open again. Remember how you hold your scissors. We're going to cut the top off your seeds. Now be careful. You don't want to spill them. Now for this, I'm going to take one of my gloves off. So I'm going to put my seeds in my hand. Alright, now I like to put 
two seeds in each hole. take this one off too. It'll be easier. So each section gets two seats. That way you have a better chance of getting a plant to grow. So my seeds are in, and now we're going to cover up our seeds. Again, you want some dirt in your cup, and you want to just put a little bit over top to cover your seeds. to go back and kind of make sure they're covered really good. Okay, now we need some water. And we're going to make sure to water really good. And again, if you do it outside, you don't have to worry about spilling water. If you accidentally spill it, it's not a big deal. Okay, now our last step to turn this into our greenhouse, you'll need some plastic wrap. just going to cover your egg carton with the plastic. Just like that. That way the sun will hit your plastic and it'll help the seeds grow. Now, if you do a lot of these, you'll probably want to use a stick. And I'm gonna poke it right down in there. And then you could use your package, because it's got a picture, and you could tape it right like that. And that way, you don't forget what's growing. Now, you'll wanna make sure you put your greenhouse somewhere where it's going to get plenty of sun. You could put it in a window sill. You could put it on a back porch where the sun hits. Just make sure it's really important that your greenhouse gets plenty of sun so the plants start sprouting. Now, once the plants start sprouting, then you'll want to remove the plastic wrap and just start watering it from there. And once your plants start growing, then you can transfer them out of this and put it into the ground. And the nice thing about using this cardboard egg carton is you can actually cut the uh, squares and you can just plant it right in the ground because it's biodegradable, which means it won't harm our dirt, our earth, and it will just you kind of evaporate along with the dirt, okay? So it's safe. All right, so now I'm going to set this over here in the sun. And you know what? It's way too nice to go back inside. So I think I'm gonna stay out for a little bit. Pete, do you wanna stay out with me? And I 
emptying, I'm gonna play with some bubbles. Maybe you guys have some bubbles. You guys can go outside and play for a little bit. All right, guys. Well, whoo, I love bubbles. Well, I hope you had fun hanging out with me this week. And I hope to see you again next week. Bye, guys.